uh, Richard Kuchin. I was at Telemann first class when I was discharged. It was not as glamorous as it sounded because technically the Rhine River Patrol, you were assigned to the Army. When they went out on, uh, when they were called out for patrol and, 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 and training uh, in the field, a ship's company, people that worked on the base, we were not a part of the of the motor ride, uh, of the ship crew. That was entirely different. I'll tell you about them. We had to go in the field with them, believe it or not, and eat K rations and blah, blah, blah. Now, the gentlemen that were assigned to the boats, these were called PR boats. They were a little larger than a PT boat. We had about eight of them. We were at the, we were at the headquarters, Schierstein, Germany, which was about five miles from Wiesbaden. There were two other bases, Mannheim and Karlsruhe. So there was three bases. We occupied the country at the time, so uh, their duty and our duty was basically to uh, patrol the Rhine and, uh, and, and, and make sure that everything was supposedly the way it should be. Uh, if we saw any violations, we could pull over any boat we wanted to or, you know, when you occupy a country, you, you can do just, just about anything you want to without fear of retribution. From the cops, even. the cops had no control. The police had no control over us, uh, unless they caught you murdering somebody on the road, on the street. They had to get you first. But uh, I was there a year, and uh, I wound up basically in crypto. The first thing they, they did was get me a top secret crypto clearance, and I worked basically in crypto at, at the Rhine River Patrol. We just established the base. Gave it back to the new German Navy a year later, and uh, they gave me new orders up the Bremerhaven to a communications unit, communications unit eight, which was a much better deal uh, than where we were in the Rhine River Patrol. That was all Navy. We were billeted at the officer's submarine base, right outside of Bremerhaven. All brick buildings, a beautiful uh, dining area. Uh, it was top shelf. In other words, I had never seen anything like this in the U.S. Navy. Uh, we were waited on hand and foot by the German help that was there. We had a large bedroom with just two two men to a bedroom. Bedroom was as large as this room, maybe larger. And there, I it was crypto and uh, teletype, and uh, that lasted a year also. And then we just then they decided to give the base back to the the German Navy again. There was Army, Air Force, and and Navy all very close, but we did not associate with anybody that was not in our own service. We went to our own bars. There was Navy bars, and there was Air Force bars, and Army bars. We did not, we did not, uh, we did not, uh, what's the word, you know, basically communicate or have anything to do with the other services. You were in the Navy, you stay in the Navy side, yeah. It was a Navy side of everything, an Army side, Air Force side. Very separate. 